Hey guys, Steve here for the Fall Up Session. Uh, I'm sitting here in the stand today because I forgot my handsaw, so I couldn't trim out this tree well. I hadn't sat in it since I started using my saddle, so. But uh, it's getting down to the end of hunting season and got a lot of wind out here today, so I thought I might just take a little bit of time and see if I can't show y'all just how this milkweed works. For the most part, the wind is in my face, but you'll see how the thermals in this little spot will actually draw the milkweed out and up. So, let's see if we can get this on camera for you. And I lost it. So you can watch it float on the current. A lot further along. If you hadn't gave it a shot, it's definitely a good option to learn the wind. And just how the land, the trees, the thermals all lack. Here is another one. So the wind isn't exactly doing what I want it to today, but we're going to give it a shot anyway, because later on in the evening, when the deer start moving and hopefully the wind dies down and the thermals start to switch from where they're rising now, it being a fairly warm, sunny day, to where they'll be falling, and I'm actually kind of at the top of a hill. That's what I want my sand to. So, we'll just have to see how this all plays out. Uh, sometimes it works in your favor, sometimes it doesn't. So, if you hadn't tried milkweed, I'd suggest you uh, find you some. There's plenty of people that are willing to send it to you. I actually bought mine online for about $6.50 uh, off of eBay. So, and I've had this bag since the beginning of the season. And as you can see, I barely used any and I throw a bunch of it. So it's well worth the 650 investment. Good luck guys. Hope you'll have a great end to your season and maybe use this to learn something about your spots for next year.